Hey everyone, it's Gwen, and as you can tell from the title, today I'm going to be talking about one of my playlists on Spotify. Someone actually commented a few months ago saying that I should start doing videos where I talk about all my different playlists that I have on Spotify. I thought that would be a really fun idea. So, since preseason has begun, and I know it's begun for probably a lot of you guys too, you know, the fall sports, gotta get back into that kind of thing. I thought that it would be a great time of the year to start talking about a playlist that I'm going to start listening to a lot. And that playlist is my pre-game jams playlist. That's what I call it on Spotify. Once again, if you guys want to follow this playlist and see what I'm always listening to on Spotify, my Spotify link is down below. I started this playlist in the end of June, and basically it's a playlist of all of the songs I'm going to listen to before my games. If you guys didn't know, I play both volleyball and softball. Volleyball in the fall, softball in the spring. So my volleyball preseason has begun and I actually have my first game this week. So I really wanted to have a playlist that I could listen to before games to get me pumped up and ready and really in the mood and the spirit of the game. And so that is what this playlist is for. So today I thought that I would talk about all the songs that I already have on the playlist. I only have 13 and I'm always gonna be adding to it. So yeah, let's just get started and go through the playlist. This first song is In Between by Beartooth. I listened to this song for the first time last year during preseason volleyball and I just fell in love with it and I also fell in love with Beartooth at the time. This song is actually the inspiration for this playlist because literally last year I played this song on repeat the entire way to all of our away games. Every time we had an away game I would sit on the bus and just constantly play this song and it got me so pumped and it got me so excited for the game and so I thought why not find more songs like this and make them into a playlist. So that's kind of the inspiration for this playlist. Caleb screaming in this song just really gets me going, and this has always been one of my favorite Beartooth songs. The middle section really reminds me of teams and teamwork, when Caleb says, I won't let pain get in my way, and he just keeps repeating that. And then he says, we have strength in numbers, strength in numbers to get us through the day. It's a lot about teamwork and coming together and defeating something. And so that's one of the reasons why it inspired me to make this playlist, because it really was about teamwork and building up to beat something. And then he says, no compromises to be made. This is a war we're gonna win. So that even more just emphasizes the fact that it's about winning and defeating. It's very inspiring and it really gets me ready to go out there and play the game and do my best. Unstoppable by Foxy Shazam. As soon as I heard this song, I knew that it would be perfect to go on this playlist. Obviously, just by the title, this already sounds like it would be a great song for this playlist. There are many great lyrics in this song, including, and we won't back down this time, and you're unstoppable, no, we can't be defeated. You know, it's all about rising to the top. And I just think it's a perfect song for this playlist. It's a great song to give me a good mindset before a game. All You Are Is History by State Champs. This song is such a great powerful beginning when Derek says, I'm a realist and an optimist, but I swear to you, I'm not getting over this. Like, it's so good. This has always been one of my favorites from around the world and back. It definitely stuck out to me the first time I heard the album. It's honestly just like such a jam. And then I love when he says, but all you are is history. You know, it's kind of an angry song, talking someone down, and it just gets me really pumped. Hey now, you're an all-star. Get your game on, go play. Hey now, you're a rock star. Get the show on, get paid. The next song is All Star by Smash Mouth, something that I'm sure all of you guys know. I feel like it's pretty obvious why this one is on here. It's clearly about sports and, you know, being an all-star in the field or the court. This song reminds me of middle school because I'm pretty sure that's when I discovered it. And when I was thinking of songs to put on this playlist, this one just instantly popped in my head. Obviously, I love when he's saying, hey now, you're an all-star, get your game on, get paid. You know, he's just, it's really, really encouraging. And at a tournament for softball, like, 
way back in the day, like, I don't even know, I was like 12 or something. I actually remember them playing this song over the loudspeakers while we were all warming up. And since then, it's just always been a really good warm-up jam, and it really just gets me in the spirit of the game, and I really love it. Also, the verses are so much fun to rap. Like, this song is so fun to sing. <laughs> Next we have Pretense by my bae's Knuckle Puck. This is my favorite song from one of my favorite albums, Copacetic. This is actually my favorite Knuckle Puck song ever. It is just so much fun to sing along to. This song always makes me want to get up and dance. Like I cannot sit still when this song is playing. It is just such a jam. And it really just gets me so pumped up and that's why it's on this playlist. The sound effects in this song are honestly unreal. And that's like my favorite part of the song is when you hear that little doo-doo. Like that's my favorite part of the entire song is just that one part. I love it so much. The lyrics are also super fun to sing during the verses. It's a very angry song, which I think gets me even more, you know, excited. And it's more fun to sing. And I love when Joe says, he just screams, go ahead, make me the bad guy. You know, it's obviously about like a relationship and he's very angry and I just love that. That to me is just such a great line. It's a very powerful line, one everyone knows if you know the song. And it is just such a jam. It's such a good song and I love it so much. If you haven't heard this song, like please go listen to Pretense. It is like one of my favorite songs I think of all time. It's so good. <laughs> But you will remember me, remember me for centuries. Next we have kind of a classic, Centuries by Fall Out Boy. A lot of the songs from American Beauty, American Psycho are known to be like jock rock and are always played at sports arenas and stuff. This song is about being remembered and legacies and it's so perfect for getting ready for games. I think I honestly love the verses of the song more than the chorus just for singing along purposes. I think it's so much fun to sing along to. In the chorus Patrick keeps saying you'll remember me for centuries you know and it reminds me of athletes and stuff like that. I love the line when Patrick says we could scream forever we are the poisoned youth. It's one of my favorite lines of the song. I just love that so much. I think it's very empowering. My songs know what you did in the dark. So light em up, 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 light em up, 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 light em up, 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 I'm on fire. Next, we have My Songs Know What You Did in the Dark by Fall Out Boy. Another song that's very famous for being played in sports arenas. This song has a very fun and empowering feel, and I cannot help but dance every time this song plays. This is a bigger song by them that I don't get tired of, and most of their bigger ones that are, you know, the ones that are playing on the radio, I do get tired of after a while. But this one has always been a favorite of mine that I've just never gotten tired of. Honestly, not too much to say about this one other than you guys know when that chorus hits, it is amazing and it just, it really gets me pumped up. Come to another song that's overplayed. Just kidding. Not really, honestly. <laughs> we have Victorious by Mabe's Panic at the Disco. This is another song that is played a ton at sports arenas. The NFL did like a big thing. I don't even know what it was. It was some like music video where they were just showing plays happening with a bunch of sports teams and this was the song in the background. It's played on the radio a ton. Even the music video is about Brendan conquering things. So clearly I had to add it onto this list. Since this is another sports song that's played in sports arenas, you already know that if Panic does win and plays at the Super Bowl next year, like, they're gonna be playing this song. Speaking of that, be sure to vote Panic. I don't actually know if this whole voting thing, like from Billboard, is a real thing or not. People seem to think it is, but if it is, there's a link in the description. Please go hit it and please go vote Panic. We want them to win. If One Direction beats Panic, like, Oh my god, I'm gonna be so pissed, honestly. Because like the fact that they're close, just just go vote panic, okay? Okay. This has a very catchy chorus along with the chanting part, you know, it's all about winning and being victorious, and it's great for games. I can sing through it all. Next 
next we have Shape Up by State Champs. I used to listen to this song all the time in the beginning of this year when I would work out at school. And it's a great song for running, especially, you know, when Derek says, shape up and stand tall. I'm always, I would be running and I'd be like, yes, I will. Like, I don't know. It was just a very empowering, inspiring song that just kept me going. And a lot of the songs on this album are really upbeat and get you jamming. Like, it's a great workout album in general. And so this is one of my favorites, which is why I added it. She was up, spit us out You know what you're breathing Next we have Aggressive by Beartooth. This is a very angry song, and just like the other Beartooth song I mentioned, Caleb's screaming just gets me going, gets me pumped. The instrumentation on the song is also really great as well, even without his screaming, the parts where it's just the instruments, the guitar is really intense and the drumming, and that alone gets me excited. The chorus specifically is my favorite part of the song, where Caleb screams, lost aggressive youth, and just like continuously screams that, I love that part. And oh my gosh, it's just, it's so fun to sing. Like, I love them so much. The next song is The Plot to Bomb the Panhandle by A Day to Remember. I recently became obsessed with this song and A Day to Remember because I'm going to see them in a week. I am so excited. I still can't even like believe I'm going to see them because even like a few months ago, I was like a casual fan of them. Like I listened to their stuff, but I wasn't a huge fan. But since I've been listening to it so much recently gearing up for this show, I'm like, I'm a really big fan now. And because of that, I just can't even believe that like I'm gonna see them in a week. Like I'm so excited. But this song is definitely one that stuck out to me and it is just so good. Right off the bat, with the guitar and the drums, it is so intense, and then Jeremy screams, I wanna let go, really loudly, and that just sets the tone for the whole song. Pretty sure this is another really angry song, which is what I like. Pretty sure this is about a relationship, so it's not really about a game or anything, but I do love the part when Jeremy repeats, I'll make my stand right here with my friends. And he just keeps saying that because that reminds me of a team, you know, a team coming together, we'll stand together. So I really do love that part of the song. Next we have Citizens of Earth by Neck Deep. This is one of my favorite Neck Deep songs of all time. And it's definitely one of my favorite tracks to ever open an album. Like you just hear the talking from the guys in the background and then the beat just drops and Ben starts screaming and it is such a fantastic opening to this album. This song gets me so lit, like you don't even want to know. If this song is playing, I have to just get up and I have to jam and just like scream along with Ben and I love it so much. And when they open with this, when I saw them in March, it was like the best thing ever because everybody was screaming all the lyrics and Ben was screaming back and it was just so amazing. This song is just so intense and it always gets me pumped up. song that's on my playlist so far is Gold Steps by Neck Deep. The lyrics and the chorus of this song are really inspiring, not to mention the, the instrumentation of this song is great, but I really picked this song and put it on here because of the lyrics. You know when Ben says, sometimes things will bend you, but trust me you'll be fine, because I've been moving mountains that I once had to climb. That's very inspiring and you know, he keeps saying, like the whole album is telling you, life's not out to get you, you know, it's gonna be okay. Like, we'll climb up these mountains, we'll get through it together, we'll fight. And that reminds me of teamwork and games and stuff like that. This is just one of my all-time faves from that album. I think it's so fun. There's also a ton of times when things get repeated in the background of the song. And seeing this song live was incredible because when the people around you know those parts when you're, you know, yelling with him. It's, it just makes it so much more fun. And this is just a fantastic song. Okay guys, so those are all the songs that are currently on my pre-game jams playlist. I'm obviously going to be adding onto this playlist. Pretty much how I'm doing it is like anytime I hear a song and notice that it either talks about empowerment or teams 
or it just has like gives me that feeling that it's just pumping me up and getting me ready you know I will be adding it onto the playlist this playlist is public on my Spotify so you could keep up with me you can listen to it you could follow it for yourself you know use it if you want to to get ready for your games or just even using it for working out is great too who knows maybe I'll do a part two of this video if I end up adding a bunch more songs over time but for right now, I am going to be listening to this playlist a lot before pretty much every game. I think it'll be a lot of fun. I'm really excited because I love, as you can tell, all of these songs are such bangers. If you haven't listened to any of the songs that I mentioned, please go check it out. I promise you will not be disappointed. They are all fantastic. But yeah, that is basically the end of this video. I want to thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to leave a comment down below if any of these songs that I mentioned today are like your favorites or your jams. Tell me which ones. Also, if you have any songs that you love to listen to while you work out or get ready for games, comment them down below with suggestions and maybe I'll listen to them and then add them onto my playlist. Other than that, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!